I think probably that some of the challenges might be people may question um, whether the improvement in those quality measures are solely due to pharmacists because the patients are being taken care of by multiple uh, providers. But I think the important thing to note is that pharmacists is part of that care team that has led to the improvement in those quality measures. So um, that might be the downside to it may, contrary to direct service reimbursement, this is more of a bundled effect. So that may become a challenge when you have to justify how much of that improvement was truly due to solely to the pharmacist.